Hi, I'm Bern Sikowski, and what I'd like to do today is take a couple of minutes and uh, talk to you a little bit about story maps. Story maps are really cool. Uh, what they do is they take a web map and marry it with a story map template that can include multimedia, photos, videos, lots of other uh, rich content, and you can assemble these very, very quickly. So some of these you can literally do in just a few minutes. So they don't require any programming, and you can make some really great examples. Let's take a look at a couple. So here I am on the ArcGIS.com website, and we featured a few of these story maps here on the gallery ribbon. We have a conference coming up next week in Palm Springs, so one of the story map templates that we've published here is what's called the Palm Springs Shortlist. So what this allows me to do is zoom around town, I can choose a theme of interest, whether it's fun, food, hotels, or design, and I can learn more about that. I can click on uh, the thumbnails and see where they are in the map and uh, get additional details and even visit the website. So that's a real interesting story map that is very simple to create. Let's take a look at another example. Uh, here's one on that same website which talks about some of the treasures of Redland. So these are interesting places around town and I can learn a little story, a little geographic based story about Redlands and some of the historic buildings and some of the other things I'd like to see. Uh, other themes of interest might involve uh, conservation. Uh, here's an interesting story map which is about the Mission Bay Marsh Reserve in San Diego. So this one lets me explore the reserve uh, visually and uh, virtually and I can learn a little bit about it, I can explore the map and I can interact with the map and see the photos which pertain to that area. So this is a great example of a map that uh, introduces me to the Mission Bay. And let's see if we can do maybe one more. Actually here's an interesting one. This is the world of story maps. So what we've done is we've built a story map that contains other story maps that let you explore these around the world. So I can click and I can view some of these story map templates and I can look at them and uh, use them. Here's one. Uh, it's in a language that I can't read but it allows me to explore a little community using a story map swipe which is very interesting. Let's uh, go over here to the United States and let's uh, check this one out here. This one happens to be a story about wine. A wine region in uh, this uh, area in Oregon and it looks like it's a tour of vineyards. So there's lots of different things that I can do uh, with these story maps and these are easy to make. Make a web map, marry it with a template and you're good to go.